Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me for the second episode in our Stanford RNA 3D Folding Competition Series. Last time, we did a detailed walkthrough of Kaggle Grandmaster Moth's incredible notebook, where we broke down the Ribbonanza net architecture, truly state-of-the-art for RNA structure prediction. Today we're studying another package for RNA structure prediction, Row Fold Plus. RNA has this incredible flexibility and forms these complex tertiary interactions that make it super difficult to model computationally. That's exactly why I'm so excited to walk through this with you today. We're going to look at every component of Row Fold Plus, see how they fit together, and really understand why this matters so much for everything from developing new drugs to understanding genetic diseases at their core. So whether you're deep into computational biology already, just curious about how machine learning is transforming science, or somewhere in between, I think you're going to get a ton out of today's exploration. Let's dive in together and unlock the secrets of RNA folding. So what exactly is Row Fold Plus? It's an advanced deep learning tool for predicting the 3D structure of RNA molecules with incredible accuracy. Think of it as having a superpower that let you see the intricate folding patterns of RNA without needing expensive lab equipment or months of experimental work. Published in Nature Methods just this year, Row Fold Plus combines the power of language models, similar to those behind ChatGPT, with specialized deep learning architectures designed specifically for RNA structure. Why is this so important? Well, RNA structure directly influences its function. From COVID vaccines to understanding genetic diseases, knowing how RNA folds helps scientists design better drugs, understand disease mechanisms, and even develop new biotechnologies. Now let's take a quick tour of what's inside the row Fold Plus repository. Don't worry if you're not a programmer, I'll keep this simple. The repository is organized really intuitively. At the top level, we have the main inference script, a control panel for making predictions. Then there's a folder for the pre-trained models. The heart of the system lives in the Raffold directory, which contains all the neural network components, utility functions, and structure refinement tools. There's also a database directory for sequence alignments and some handy scripts for processing multiple sequence alignments or MSAs. Setting up Row Fold Plus is surprisingly straightforward, especially for something this powerful. You start by cloning the repository from GitHub, then create a conda environment using their provided environment file. After activating the environment, you install the package and download the pre-trained model. The pre-trained model is about 1 GB, so not too huge by today's standards. Now, there's an optional step that's really cool if you're serious about accuracy. You can download their sequence databases for creating multiple sequence alignments. Fair warning though, this is about 900 GB. But don't panic, there's an online server option if you don't want to set everything up locally. Let's talk about what makes Row Fold Plus so powerful. At its core, Row Fold Plus has several key components working together. First, it uses a language model called RNAFM that's been trained on tons of RNA sequences. Think of this as having read millions of RNA books to understand their language. This diagram shows the inner workings of its RNA structure prediction system. It starts with the input data, which includes tokens, RNA language model tokens, and sequences. This information first flows into the MSA embedder, which processes multiple sequence alignments. The representations go to the E2FMR stack, which is really the heart of the system. It takes those embedded features and transforms them producing rich representations that capture all the complex relationships within RNA structures. What's particularly clever about this design is the recycling embedder you see at the top right. It creates this feedback loop where information gets refined over and over, up to n times as noted in that recycling path label at the bottom. From the E2FMR, information branches out to two key modules. First, there's the structure module using those forward chords parameters to build the actual 3D structural elements. Then, there's the heads module with its forward heads approach, 
which manages three specific prediction components, the PLDDT head for confidence scoring, the SS head handling secondary structure, and the DIST head calculating those critical distance predictions. Everything ultimately converges to generate the output you see on the left side. Those green dotted lines show you how information cycles back through the system, creating an iterative refinement process that keeps improving the predictions with each pass. It's like the system gets multiple chances to check its work and make it better each time. That's what gives Rowfold its remarkable accuracy in predicting RNA structures. The prediction workflow in Rowfold Plus is elegant and effective. Let me walk you through what happens when you feed it an RNA sequence. First, it processes your input, either a single RNA sequence or, better yet, multiple aligned sequences that show evolutionary patterns. These sequences get embedded into a vector representation that captures their essence. Next, the model builds a pairwise representation, essentially figuring out how different parts of the RNA might interact with each other. The transformer components then process this information through multiple layers, gradually refining the understanding of the structure. As we have seen before, Row Fold Plus doesn't just make one prediction and call it a day. It uses a recycling approach, feeding its initial predictions back in for multiple iterations, refining as it goes. Finally, the predicted coordinates are converted to standard PDB format that biologists use and can be further refined using physics-based simulations to ensure they obey the laws of molecular physics. Using row fold plus for predictions is pretty simple. The main script, inference.py, is your gateway to RNA structure prediction. To run a basic prediction, you just need to provide an input FASTA file with your RNA sequence, specify an output directory, and point to the pre-trained model. If you have a multiple sequence alignment in A3M format, that's even better. Just include it with the input A3M parameter. Want to run it on GPU for faster predictions? Just add device CUDA. Need structure refinement? Specify the number of steps with relax steps. Let me show you a quick example. You can use the provided input data under folder example and simply run this command. However, the script always uses CPU for AMBER relaxation even when GPU is available, which slows it down significantly. I have submitted a pull request to fix it. With the fix, in a matter of two minutes, or longer for complex RNAs, you'll have a full 3D structure prediction. It's like having a molecular microscope at your fingertips. Let's talk about what you actually get after running Row Fold Plus. The output is comprehensive and ready for scientific analysis. In your specified output directory, you'll find several key files. There's a results NPZ file with the distogram predictions, essentially the predicted distances between different parts of the RNA. You'll get a secondary structure prediction in CT format, showing which nucleotides pair with each other. There's also a detailed log file that shows you exactly what happened during the prediction process, including timing information for each step. The star of the show is the PDB file, either unrelaxed model PDB for the raw prediction or relaxed model PDB for the refined version. These are standard format files that can be opened in any molecular visualization software like PyMol or Chimera. For example, I uploaded the inference output to an online 3D viewer, where you can rotate it, zoom in on interesting features, or even create beautiful renderings for publications or presentations. Now let's look at some of the advanced features that really set Row Fold Plus apart. One of the coolest aspects is how it handles multiple sequence alignments, or MSAs. Having evolutionarily related sequences dramatically improves prediction accuracy, but sometimes these alignments can be huge and unwieldy. Row Fold Plus has clever solutions for this. There's a clustering script that uses k-means to group similar sequences, preserving diversity while keeping the computation manageable. There's also a random sampling script if you prefer that approach. Another advanced feature is structure refinement. After the initial prediction, Row Fold Plus can use the AMBER molecular dynamics engine to further refine the structure, making sure it respects physical laws and energetics. 
The refinement process adds hydrogens, performs energy minimization, and outputs a physically realistic structure. And all this happens automatically when you use the inference script with relaxation steps enabled. Row Fold Plus isn't just a standalone tool, it's designed to integrate smoothly into larger research pipelines and workflows. For advanced users, there's a Python API that lets you incorporate Row Fold Plus directly into your own code. This is perfect if you're processing multiple RNA sequences, doing large scale analysis, or building custom pipelines that combine structure prediction with other analyses. Another advanced use case is working with custom MSAs. You might have specialized alignments from your own research, or you might want to experiment with different clustering or sampling approaches to see how they affect prediction accuracy. You can also customize the refinement process, adjusting parameters to suit your specific research questions. Maybe you need extra refinement steps for a particularly complex RNA, or perhaps you want to focus on specific regions of interest. Think of Row Fold Plus as a flexible tool in your computational biology toolkit. Powerful on its own, but even more powerful when combined with your own expertise and custom approaches. So there you have it, a comprehensive tour of Row Fold Plus, a cutting edge tool that's changing the game in RNA structure prediction. To recap what we've covered, Row Fold Plus combines deep learning with language models to predict RNA 3D structure with remarkable accuracy. It leverages evolutionary information from multiple sequence alignments, incorporates physics-based refinement, and provides a complete pipeline from sequence to structure. The implications are huge. Better RNA structure prediction means faster drug development, deeper understanding of genetic diseases, improved RNA-based technologies like mRNA vaccines, and fundamental advances in our understanding of molecular biology. If you want to try Row Fold Plus yourself, all the resources are freely available. The GitHub repository has complete documentation, there's an online server if you don't want to install it locally, and the paper in Nature Methods provides all the scientific details. I hope this walkthrough has been helpful and maybe even inspired you to explore the fascinating world of RNA structure prediction. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and subscribe for more content on cutting-edge AI applications in science. Drop a comment if you have questions or if there are other tools you'd like me to cover. And hey, if you end up using Row Fold Plus in your research, I'd love to hear about it. Share your experiences in the comments. Until next time, happy predicting!